And now we're taking a live look here from Hyatt Centric Camera in South Park. And so far, people over in that area, the Queen City, have been dealing with just a lot of cold rain right now. Queen City News has live team coverage for you tonight as this third round of snow moves into the Charlotte area. We begin with Queen City News anchor Ryan Kruger live in Uptown right now. And Ryan, what are you seeing there? Yeah, so Brian, uh, precipitation just really kind of started. It may not show up on camera very well. It's definitely a mix. It's right now it just feels like cold rain. You can kind of see some fluffy little snowflakes every once in a while appearing. Uh, very cold. That wind also is biting. I'm kind of uh, regretting that I don't have my hat on right now because my ears are certainly cold. People are bundled up and, you know, out here all night chatting with folks. One thing is clear. Everyone pretty sick and tired of all the w uh, winter weather. A busy Friday night in South End Charlotte. As folks bundle up to go out to dinner, the winter weather is on everyone's mind. I've never seen snow here, so I was shocked. I was like, okay, there's no way. You guys say snow and it will be two flakes, but <laughs> it was legit. My kids played in the snow. The Queen City hasn't seen snow in three weeks in January in more than half a century. Longtime locals like Kenny Ramsey can't believe what they are seeing. Feels like it hadn't snowed here in forever, and all of a sudden, three weeks in a row, it's kind of crazy. But in a city of transplants, you're sure to have those with strong opinions about locals in the snow. They like it for about 20 minutes, and then they just they freak out after that. It's it, I don't know. It gets to about like a half an inch, and they're like, all right, I'm done. George Schmidt grew up in Cleveland, so our version of snow is vastly different from that which he grew up with. The main thing is the driving. Everyone, they see an inch of snow, and they're like, they instantly don't know how to drive. One thing is for sure, after three weeks, it certainly seems like everyone is starting to get a hang of all this snow. I thought that our town did great by clearing the streets. They put salt on driveways, they put salt on streets, so I was impressed. All right, and one thing to keep in mind, uh, because those temperatures are expected to drop so low, there is a lot of moisture on the ground. Even though right now so far it has just been rain because it's going to get so cold, uh, uh, Charlotte Mecklenburg Emergency Management is out here saying, take it easy tonight, take it easy tomorrow morning, because there are definitely going to be some slick spots out on the roads. We're live tonight in Uptown, Ryan Kruger. Queen City News. Yeah, something to watch out for and a hat definitely needed with these cold temps. All right, Ryan, thanks.